I'm Jenna Rice, I'm an artist. Uh, I own my own art business now, Jenna Rice Art, LLC. I'm just doing what I love every day, it's a wonderful thing, and uh, now I get to be involved in uh, some wonderful charities. Now I'm involved in uh, Feed the Frontline at Cone Health. I am painting on a truck, as you see behind me. Uh, it's pretty cool, I'm very excited about that. Uh, and I'm recreating the mural that uh, gained a bunch of attention uh, from the local media. So I decided to paint a mural of a nurse. This is gorgeous. Jennifer Youngwood, an ER nurse from Western North Carolina, says she drove three hours today to see a mural of herself. How do you like the picture? <laughs> It is gorgeous. It is absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so much. Yeah. So I created this GoFundMe account, started taking donations. Next thing you know, we've got a thousand dollars. We go to Stamey's, uh, got a got a hundred meals, and I wake up the next morning and there's another thousand dollars there. And so we we fed another hundred. Uh, the next day there was another thousand there. We fed another hundred. So then. Uh... I was contacted by Maury Kennedy. He wanted to use these t-shirts to fundraise for Feed the Frontline. Then later on, uh, Maury suggested, well, how about we recreate this mural in front of the hospital? You know about the mural painted by Jenna Rice, the artist, and the shirt provided by uh, Triad Paw Prints. Well, so now we're doing the mural on a box truck that Marty Cotis has donated for our use. And we're here at uh, Cotis Street Art. If you can see in the background, Jenna is actually painting the mural onto the truck. So then I contacted uh, Marty Cotis. He actually had this giant truck that's right behind me. And he's like, you know, it'd be really cool if you just like paint it on a truck. And uh, so here I am painting, uh, recreating this mural on a, on a truck. And the, so this truck will serve as a gigantic reminder to the nurses how much we appreciate them. But here's the coolest part yet. Everybody who donates, their name will be inscribed on the truck as well. So uh, Mako of Greensboro is also sponsoring this project. Um, they're also going to put like a sealant um, over the painting as well so it lasts much longer. Hey, my name is Phil Collins uh, with Mako Auto Painting. Uh, North Carolina. Uh, here at Mako, we've uh, been known as an auto painting and collision facility uh, in the U.S. Uh, and here in Greensboro for over 45 years. Jenna brought this truck by us today for us to give a sneak peek at what that uh, work is going to look like and uh, done a great job. We're officially going to roll this truck out Friday, uh, May 1st, for a rollout at uh, Burger Warfare. And of course, Mako is proud to, to support uh, that uh, luncheon. I just want to say thank you to everyone that helped put this project together. You know, uh, if it weren't for them, this wouldn't be happening. And uh, I'm just, I'm very grateful to be a part of this and very grateful to uh, help the community in the process. <laughs>